It's been really nice staying in Vincennes because it's been really calm, quiet, and I've gotten to get a lot done, which is really nice. Um, it's kind of eerie being just in a place like so devoid of people. I'm not just Vincennes, but the Paris area empties out in the month of August. I've already had some people that I've reached out to to network and talk about potential job positions, tell me, sounds great, would love to meet you, but let's, let's make that happen at a rentrée. And the rentrée is the return. It's the beginning of September when the academic and professional year restarts in France. So I've already had people say, yeah, that's great, but I'm going on vacation, so reach back out in September. Tomorrow I go to a different town just outside of Paris. I'm gonna move all my belongings. And it's fun, it's like a fresh start. And in some ways feels like the beginning, the true beginning to my journey. I made it guys and I had like the nicest driver. Like he was cracking me up, like so hilarious. Uber drivers and different people find out that I'm not French, then they just let loose and they start telling me all their thoughts and like it's kind of just a sounding board for being a foreigner here and like it's just like a therapy session honestly. Right now I'm cleaning the room in quadrants because maybe I can do them with her clean later, but right now I can't move the bed totally out of the way. So I'm cleaning the floor in little bits and pieces as I move the bed around. I finished cleaning the room. Uh, next, I've got to go pick up some sheets and blankets, a pillow, and I'm meeting a friend later tonight as well, so I'm gonna go pick up all of that stuff, meet my friend, and then I guess tonight I'll finish setting up the room. I'm back from hanging out with my friend. It's pretty funny because I arrived at our meetup carrying like all of this stuff and more because this is all of my bedding oh no this is like way too big so i don't know if i already explained why i'm living here I'm right now in a shared living space. It's a three bedroom apartment. Um, one of the other people and their girlfriend are here right now. Maybe you can hear them. If so, I apologize. But I'm here because I was hoping to live in student housing that I lived in in the past times of France and they didn't have space. So they say. Um, it's, it's hard. If you're in the know, you're in the know. But for the housing situation, it's very hard to believe that they don't have rooms at this house, but I digress. Something to be said for student housing, it's really nice and affordable and stable and guaranteed, but you know, living on your own, living out in your own housing out in the city, like it's independent, it's, it's you know, more personal and um, yeah, more free. So there's pros and cons to both and I don't really have much of an option. This is the route that I'm doing. Hi guys, please join me for my morning coffee. So it's been a couple of days since I filmed. That's mostly because I've been doing stuff. I 
I had to get off that plane and start hustling. Like, I didn't have any other choice. As I'm pretty sure I've talked about, as you might know, I'm not able to live in my first choice place in Paris. I sent in my candidature, my application, and I went and talked to the house manager and the answer was no. So that's the update that I wanted to give you guys today because that's what's really on my mind. If I really want to keep my vision alive of having my own place in Paris, I will have to have my work contract and I will have to, before that happens, live in temporary spots. And so I guess it's a question of, am I okay with moving around until I have a solid place that is my goal? Or do I substitute that with a long-term option that's stable and meets some of the things I need, uh, but will make it longer until I reach my goal? Does that make sense? I'm prepping for an interview that I have tomorrow. I'm on my way to the interview. I wanted to give you guys a job update because you're probably curious. Each action I'm getting closer to what I want to do and to the life that I want to live here. 